welcome to Superwall Style. This is Prachi, and today I will be sharing with you my manicure routine because my nails look absolutely outrageously disgusting. Like none of the sizes, shapes, nothing matches. The only thing that matches for my nails right now is the yellow color, which is not really a very good thing. And uh, guys, before proceeding, just one very important thing I want to mention. So a couple of weeks ago, I went up on Instagram and I had received this box and this box from Eba. So I posted on my stories. I was just excited. A lot of you came back and told me that you want a review. So what I will do in today's video, guys, I will show you my manicure routine and I will give you a quick review because I've, I have uh, tried these uh, nail polishes out on my toes and I wasn't wearing them right now, but I have used them on my toes and I have noticed a few things. So I want to share that with you all. So yes, if you want to know more, just keep watching. So start by first, obviously removing all the old nail polish, a very basic and a very important step. And uh, what I'm using here is the Eba Nail Color Remover. Now for all those of you who wanted to know guys, it contains argan oil, which is very good, you know, for moisturizing your nails, for taking care of your nails, especially if your nails are very brittle and dry. Also it's acetone free, alcohol free and paraben free. So all of these are a, are a huge plus. Then I'm going to quickly mix a little bit of toothpaste. I recommend using a white colored toothpaste in this case with a few drops of lemon juice and uh, then take a brush. Now here it is very important to use an old soft brush like this brush I have had with me for years only for my nails. It's all like soft soft you know and uh, brush your nails with this for about one to two minutes depending on how much patience you have this is a very good step for all those of you who have yellow nails because with this what will happen guys is that in one use you will start seeing a difference you will start seeing that the nail yellow color is going away so that's nice um then you know how manicure is not just about your nails but also about your hands so very quickly you're gonna trim all the hair from my hands because nobody likes it i think at least women usually don't like having that and um, guys so you know how in salons they use like they clean your hands and scrub your hands and things like that well i came up with a genius hack today because i had to review these products for you all and you wanted to know more i will also very quickly review the eba instant facial uh, product so this is basically a face product which you use on your face and it's a three-in-one wash scrub and mask wash scrub and mask it contains rose petals multani mitti and walnut scrub so that's like an added bonus and i have used it on my face for two or three times i like it you know it kind of refreshes the skin and it has an amazing fragrance it uh, makes you feel good and fresh and you can see like the skin looks nice so uh, i'm just gonna use apply this on my hands just to demonstrate it you know although it's supposed to be used for the face i'm just using it on my hands then after a little while you can just wash off your hands and yes now the hands are all nice and clean then what i'm going to do guys is i'm going to take a few drops a little bit of coconut oil and just apply it around my on my cuticles this is a very good step before you work with your cuticles because it'll just take care you know like otherwise people sometimes they break they hurt their cuticles so with a coconut oil it's better then take a cuticle pusher if you don't have a cuticle pusher you can take anything with a nice rounded edge just make sure it is clean so you don't end up with nail infections right so very gently push off your cuticles a little bit like don't have to push it too hard or don't have to cut it even i used to cut my cuticles before guys and now have learned a very important lesson to not to do that you can end up with severe nail infections by cutting your cuticles so just uh, push back gently to give it a neat look but don't uh, irritate it too much and uh, once the cuticles are ready if you want you can dip your fingernails in a bowl of warm water for about 10 20 seconds um don't dip it for too long but uh, what happens is that you know warm water can actually make your nails even softer and because my nails are in such a bad condition i have to clip them off a little bit this is not a mandatory step for instance if your nails are already very short and more or less on the same size you don't need to use a clipper but i need to so just very quickly gonna clip the excess and then taking a filer now while talking about a filer guys i just want to mention something i am using a steel filer but 
those uh, sandy glass filers are actually better i don't have one right now so i'm not using it but that is a tip which i wanted to share so start by filing your nails now personally for me the square tip nails don't work very well because it starts chipping from the sides very quickly for uh, so i'm going to be doing a round manicure and this is how i do it so start with the corners okay first quickly start with the corners and then slowly move your way to the top why i like to do it this way is because you know sometimes what happens is that when you start from one side and move to the other side in this direction instead of going from the sides and then up is that uh, you can end up with a weird curve like not like a proper curve but something that goes up like this something like a graph you know so if you want to avoid that just manicure like this from the sides and then to the top and yes once you're happy with the shape of your nails time for the nail polish but before that just wipe your nails and clean everything very well especially make sure there's no coconut oil or anything on your nail because then you know it's not good for the nail polish when you want to put it so yes just clean up everything and um, then move into the nail polish so guys i will not use a base coat today because eba nail colors with these nail colors you don't have to use a base coat you don't have to use a top coat also but i'll talk more about that later so uh, if you if you want you can use a base coat but with eba nail colors no base coat is required and uh, a quick review in the process guys uh, these nail colors they contain argan oil like i said it's very good for dry brittle nails especially and um, you know it's one of a kind the first time in india we have the concept of breathable nail colors so um i'll tell you what happens when you when we apply nail color usually when we apply the nail colors is that it creates a coat a coating right a cosmetic coating on your hands on your fingers and on your nails it creates a cosmetic coating on your fingers which is first of all toxic number two what happens is that because of that coat oxygen uh, and moisture cannot penetrate your nails it cannot touch the nails because there is this color right because of which the nails get yellow dry brittle so your nails need to breathe and with eba what what they have done is they have arranged the molecules of the formulation in such a way that it can actually get the oxygen and it can also get the moisture from the air if you want to just wash your hands for like 20 seconds under water and uh, the moisture will penetrate so you know this is what this nail color does also by the way it's i mean uh because it's non toxic it's actually safer especially if you're somebody who's a biter uh it's also vegan and cruelty free and all of those things more details links everything in the description box below if you want to know more so i think you know after this great fiasco i'm going to call this a great nail fiasco of 2018 because my nails have never looked this bad i think uh, after this i'm going to switch to eba because they look promising like i've used them on my toes and now my toes look fine so <laughs> i think um, i'm going to switch to these nail colors because they look very promising and uh, they also last for a considerable amount of time by the way while i apply the nail color here is a quick hack if you tend to get spillage on the sides you, what you can do is you can apply a little bit of petroleum jelly or coconut oil again just on the sides don't touch the nail just on the sides so that when your nail polish actually goes out you can clean it up immediately so you don't have to go through a lot of mess for that and uh, this is how you actually apply nail polish guys just uh, by the way you um, shake the bottle like this all right shake the bottle like this and then obviously take just a little bit of the nail color make sure that the brush is not entirely dipping with the nail polish and then very gradually starting from the center move to the sides why we go from center to the sides is because you know as you press the brush it kind of you know goes like this the brush um, kind of uh, goes in all directions so when you're holding the nail polish brush at the center of your nail it you know gives you the nice the nice form and a proper color and only apply in one direction don't apply in three four directions and immediately after applying don't apply the second coat let it dry and then apply a second coat although with these nail colors if you don't want to use a second coat they are not required because it's very very you know the colors are quite bright so yes that was my manicure routine this is what my nails are looking like right now and just telling you guys if your nails look bad if i can fix these nails anything any nail in this world can be fixed i feel so guys on that note let me end today's video and also quickly remind you to not forget to 
subscribe to this channel turn on the bell icon for notifications keep watching for more by the way if you want the swatches i'll just end the video with the swatches but uh, while you watch you can also hit like you know so yes guys that's all for now thank you so much for watching but you keep watching i'll go now bye <laughs> bye